To give you an idea of how our products work, we're going to do an oil change on a lawnmower. Normally on a lawnmower, you need to tilt it so that you can access the drain plug underneath. This can be tricky to do and usually leads to messy spills. Now with Pella oil extractors, you don't need to remove drain plugs, so the whole process is greatly simplified. Before you begin, you need to warm up the oil. This will allow the oil to flow better and also allow any dirt to mix and to suspend in the oil. You want the oil warm but not burning hot. The way to tell is by examining the dipstick. Using a rag, if you feel that the dipstick is burning hot, that means the oil is also too hot. So you would need to allow it to cool off a bit. But in this case, it's just warm, so we're ready to go. So all you need to do is drop the tube down the filler net till it touches the bottom, and then you're going to pump the unit. By pumping the unit, you're pumping air out of the container through this valve at the top. So by removing air from the container, that's how you create the vacuum in here. And once the vacuum starts, the oil will get sucked out of the engine through this tube, and it'll drain into the container. I'm using the Pella 2000 model for this demo. So on this model, you need to pump it 10 times in a row in the beginning to get a strong vacuum started. The 10 pumps should take you about 10 seconds to do. So watch the tube and I'll begin pumping. So as you can see, the oil is getting sucked in automatically. It'll continue by itself. You do not need to pump continuously. Just let it run by itself. The container is see-through and graduated, so you'll be able to measure how much oil has been removed. So it's running by itself. Occasionally you can give it a few more pumps. And as you can hear, we're sucking in air now, so that means we're nearing the end. I'm just going to pump it a few more times to get out the residual oil. And we should be about done. And there we go. I won't do it in this video. But after you've added fresh oil, you should check the oil level using the dipstick. If you've added too much oil, you can always extract it out. Now to empty the unit, just remove the tube and the pump and just pour into this empty container. And then you can bring it for recycling. So as you can see, Pella oil extractors are very easy to use and they're very clean. This was just one of the many useful applications. We also have other models with larger capacities. So for more information, please visit our website www.pellaproducts.com.